Here's an update on the garage section. We'll go ahead and start over here. This is a new rack, just built not too long ago. Wasn't on the last videos. And here we got a 16, and I'm hoping I got mascara bar babies. There's some fish in there. I'm just hoping they weren't rainbow fish eggs that were still scattered in the tank the barbs are in. Under here, nothing yet. I'm trying to get a grass carpet growing. May try to use it for breeding. Here, this thing sprung a leak. So I just dropped the water level a little bit. You can see it right here on the wood. Discolored a little bit. Just dropped the water level, took all the rainbow fish out, and used it as a killie tank, because they're jumpers anyway, so. With not as much pressure on it, it quit leaking. There's a very small leak. You can see a few baby blue glars swimming around there. Probably 40 or so in there. And then here I have some Herbert Axorati and some Parkinsoni rainbow fish. They're ready to be sold and moved. And on the other side. Up here we got some angelfish waiting for their new owners. A couple beta fish bred from Fancy Beta. I got the parents from Jakarta, Indonesia. How oh, beautiful fins. Love the blues on them. The blue one in here somewhere. He's so blue. It's almost unreal. Yeah, there he is. Super blue. He's hiding. Or while she. Up here we got the pseudo lumin luminatus, something like that. A bunch of them. Some spun them off in there. Angelfish, ton of angelfish. I think there's a hundred and two of them in there. Some random Anubias. I love these fish. Give you little fish kisses. All right, and down here, this is a community tank. A couple of iridescent sharks down there. They're actually should be getting a new home today. We need a bigger tank. So I sold them to a monster fish keeper. There's an owl and I right there. This is gonna end up getting a rehaul and be my small rainbow fish community tank. And up here. We got the home of the mascara barbs, the similis. Pretty rare. They love it in here, especially with all the algae. There's a blue neon goby pair in here too. Some male and female in here. Actually a couple baby rainbow fish up there because my before I put all the barbs in here I kept a bunch of rainbow fish in here. Grow them out. Love these things. I hope those are babies in the other tank. I'm trying to breed them for a while. And up here, the tank has a few pygmy rainbow fish babies in it. It's very hard to see. It's a Rubavada Waponga Red Laser. This is pretty new rainbow fish to the hobby. It was featured on the cover of Amazonas Magazine. A few articles ago, or mega issues ago. Love that fish. Got a few babies of it. And another thing. And here I got Bomani babies. Not Bose Money, but Bo Money rainbow fish babies. Pretty rare fish as well. Really hard to see the babies. This is a rainbow tiger inler tank. With mostly the flame tail attribute to it. Down here, a bunch of baby dwarf neon rainbow fish. You can see a few swimming up top there. Kind of cloudy in there. I'll end up putting grass in there as well. Turn it into a breeding tank. 
Had some eggs in there. Those breeding project tank. Trying to get some embers to breed two ember tetras. This is the Starburst Blue Star Endler tank. Rare crab. I can't remember which one it is though. A couple more rare cribs. A breeding group of pygmy rainbows. They're being shy. Males being awful protective. Love those fish too. Another group of angelfish. And this. Has some Dekai Goldie rainbow fish or Goldia Dekai rainbow fish babies. You can't really see them through that green water, but they love that green water. And here we got some signifers being shy. They don't really care for the open glass tank. They're kind of missing their planted tank. And here I got a braiding pair of. Latakara buckle cops. Just dropped the water level on them. About to stick some RO in there. Soften the water up. And that, when I switch it back to hard, it usually triggers them to spawn. Here, a couple of dwarf neon babies. Not many. And here's some more dwarf neon babies. A bunch. Nothing. And this is Cali Rum Rainbow Fish. And Cali Rum. It's a brand new species in the hobby. I think there's only two people in the States that even have the fish. I don't know, I could be wrong about that. Pretty sure it was discovered this year though. And this is what I use to do my water changes. Now I discharge all my water, just follows the hose, and goes out the door. And here I got braiding projects going for salt water, mostly with blue galaris hatching recently. Still trying to get some tetras going. There's some baby blue galaris in here. About to build a whole new table. There's a couple babies there. And on the other side, just a couple tanks. Kind of dark. Can't really see. Don't have much going on in them. I'm about to build a new table there. Move that table over here for other projects. That'll be my soft water section. And that is the garage right now.